What's going on everybody, Rob A here, and today we're taking a look at Transformers Bot Bots. Uh, these are new blind packed transforming figures from Hasbro, and uh, <clears throat> I found these at my local Walmart. They were $2.97 a piece, I believe. Uh, so yeah, pretty cheap. They are very small though. I don't know if you can see how tiny these are. Um, but yeah, pretty exciting. So. I'm going to go ahead and open these up. I got three of them here. Uh, they do, there are 24 different kinds uh, in series one at the very least. They got little fun uh, alt modes and they turn into, you know, weird and wacky things like ice cream and toilets and weird stuff like that. Um, so there is actually a little code on each package. Uh, it's very hard to see. It's just printed. It's not printed. It's uh, like stamped in there. And this one is 82571. This one is 82541, and then this one is 82581. So hopefully that means uh, there'll be some way of discerning uh, which is which, at the very least finding out whether or not you've got three different figures, because obviously you don't want to go rooting around for 24 of the same figure, because <laughs> that would be kind of annoying. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and start these off. And the first one I'm gonna open is 82571. So just in case they uh, they do in fact have a different code for each one, we're gonna use that. So it says to open up, you wanna lift this little flap and then push down the front of the package. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. And so 82571 gives us a little camera dude that's pretty cool uh so let's see what we've actually got here Ooh, all right so there is some really crinkly uh paperwork in here and we got sa cheese he is level two which i assume is his uh, uh rarity level uh so we'll go ahead and check this dude out. So we're going to go ahead and lift this little flap here. You can already see his little face. Uh, super cute. Uh, and then we twist it down. Okay. And what do we do? What is this all? Oh, okay. I see what's up. I see what's up. Okay. So this is his other arm. Gotcha. All right. All right I got it. I got it. And then we just kind of pull, ooh, pull a little too hard. There we go. Let me just pull these down. So, all right, I see what's up. So he's got this little, one little arm here. It's kind of a little camera arm thing, I guess. And then this arm, that maybe is a laser. I don't know, but he's had these little feet and uh, this ball joint wants to keep popping off uh, because you have to, you're supposed to pull the legs down on these little stalks, but the ball joint does pop off. However, as much as this thing is popping off, uh, this feels like a very, very solid figure. Um, I thought it was metal at first when I was holding it, but it is is—it is definitely not. It is plastic, but uh, just very solid plastic. So there is S.A. Cheese uh, in the first one. You can see what the packaging looks like. you got Mr. Cheese right there and some of the techie team kind of hanging out in the back. And uh, I guess here is a... Wow, that's a, that's a lot to, to take in all at once. This is, I guess, all of the 24 figures uh, that you can get in Wave 1. So that's a, that's a lot of stuff. All right, moving right along. Let's put S.A. Cheese back over here. Uh, number two, we got 82541. I'm going to go ahead and lift this up again. And then poop them out. And we got a big red something or other. Okay. Uh, looks like a boxing glove. And the only problem with popping it out the way it says in the instructions is that it totally decimates the paper, uh, which, you know, is kind of fun to have intact, you know? Uh, so this is also level two. This is Kid Clobber. 
He turns into it from a boxing glove into a little boxer. All right, all right, all right. So you just pop out his arm, pop out his other arm, and then lift up his little uh, hat. And I guess his feet come down a little bit here, maybe. Yeah, it looks like his feet come down just a smidge and no more. So there is Kid Clobber. Real cute. He's a nice little, cute little dude. Um, it is weird that the boxing glove has a boxing glove thumb on it. Um, but yeah, you guys get the idea. It turns into a boxing glove. You can get the, get the gist of it. Yeah, super cute. So that is Kid Clobber number two. All right. <laughs> these feet. These feet, man. Always with the feet with these. I mean, I've only got two figures to really judge that by, but, man. All right, there you go. So there is Kid Clobber. We're going to put him right there, and we'll check out the Jock Squad here. Check out the rest of the Jock Squad. And I assume the other side is going to be the exact same. Yeah, it's the same same poster. And it's, uh, it's, again, just a lot to look at. So there you go. On to the third. It is 82581. Just going to go ahead and pop this open. I guess we'll do the same. The same deal here. Tear it up. And then we've got... Looks like a briefcase or something. Or a bag of some kind. Maybe the, maybe the name will uh, will give it away. Of exactly what we've got. This is... Oh, alright, alright. It's Totes my goats. Okay, alright. Totes my goats. Indeed. Alright. He is level 1, so I guess he's like super, super common. Alright. Uh, unlike the Fallout 76 messenger bag. What? So he's part of the backpack bunch. You guys can see it's a bunch of equipment, school stuff. That's interesting. Um, yeah, and he should be pretty easy to transform. So we're going to go ahead and pull his head up here. And he's got a little bit of wiggle going on there. All right, all right, all right. Pull the arms out. Okay, got his arms going. And then the feet. And the feet, thankfully, just flip down. There you go. There is Totes Magoats, and uh, he's very cute. I like this one. I don't, I don't know how much I like his arms, but uh, I do like that he's just like a little, little tote bag. It's pretty neat. He's got some pockets, got some nice printing on there. Yeah, so, um, you know, come on, feet. <laughs> feet, don't fail me now. Again, as always, you little boogers. Um, so he is, all right, he does stand up. Okay. So we had a little trouble standing up here. Let me see if I can get these guys in the frame. All right. So, um, yeah, really, uh, adorable little line of figures. Uh, super nice, just simple blind packed characters. Uh, nice to have on your desk for display or whatever. Um, really good stocking stuffers, probably. Um, so yeah, pretty neat. Um, I'm going to let you guys tell me in the comments whether or not I should get some more of these uh, for another video or two. Uh, or if you're not interested, tell me that too. Also, if, uh, if you've been buying these on your own, you've been checking out the codes, let me know if your codes are the same as mine or if they are different if they vary from uh, line to line like uh, other blind packed figures do or or not or if they're same across all the all the way because that'd be really interesting to know so that's going to do it for this for you guys i want to thank you so very much for watching as always if you enjoyed the video please hit that like button it really helps me out of course subscribe if you want to see more i'll have more transformers in the future very soon uh not sure if i'll have bot bots but let me know about that and we'll figure it out. In the meantime, thanks again for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.